Hi guys, my name is Anna and welcome back to my channel. In today's video, I've prepared a topic that I find really interesting. I hope you do too. We are witnessing something amazing, the birth of a fashion brand that could become mega successful or not. If you were or obsessed with Formula One, Michael Schumacher and have that cup in your wardrobe, you will understand what I'm going to talk about. In this video, you will find out about Ferrari, not as a car brand or Formula One driver, but as an influential fashion brand and trendsetter. Before I start, don't forget to subscribe to my channel and to hit the bell to not miss the next video. Ferrari has officially entered the fashion world with its debut at Milan Fashion Week in June 2021. This marked a significant expansion of the brand's portfolio, positioning Ferrari not just as a car giant, but also as a player in the high-end fashion industry. Ferrari was founded by Enzo Ferrari in Maranello, Italy in September 1939 as Auto Avio Construzioni. In 1950, Ferrari joined Formula One, making it the oldest and one of the most successful teams in the history of the sport. Scuderia Ferrari, the racing division of the Italian sports car manufacturer Ferrari, participated in the very first Formula One World Championship season. Since then, Ferrari has become synonymous with Formula One racing, achieving numerous championships and becoming a cornerstone of the sport. As a result, Ferrari has built an incredible reputation all over the world and, most importantly, it has a huge budget. All these factors I dream come true for any business. Which is why, I suppose, they've entered high fashion to engage with younger, fashion-forward demographic. By offering trendy and luxurious clothing, Ferrari can attract younger consumers who may not yet be in the market for high-end sports car, but could be potential future buyers. This particularly relevant as the Formula One generation ages, even those who remember, remember Fernando Alonso and Michael Schumacher may now look to Ferrari for more than just cars. An interesting fact is that there are no other car manufacturers in fashion at the moment. Some brands like Porsche, BMW and Mercedes sell their merch, but not attend Fashion Week. For example, Mercedes-Benz has a significant presence by sponsoring the Fashion Weeks in multiple cities and in this way reinforces its global reach and influence in the luxury market. Each event helps to strengthen the brand's association with high-end fashion and a sophisticated lifestyle. But compared to Ferrari, Mercedes does not have its own fashion clothing line with a dedicated creative director. This gives Ferrari a unique edge in the luxury fashion industry. In 2019, Rocco Iannone was appointed creative director for Ferrari's fashion line. He was born and raised in Calabria, Italy and graduated from the Instituto Maragoni in Milan. Iannone, who has an impressive background working with renowned fashion houses such as Armani, Pauzoleri and Dolce & Gabbana, has created a signature style and brought a fresh perspective to Ferrari's fashion endeavors. There is a huge responsibility on Iannone's shoulders because he is Ferrari's first ever creative director. He faces the challenge of creating a fashion identity without a historical fashion archive unlike other designers who work for fashion houses. However, this also gives him the freedom to innovate, drawing inspiration from Ferrari's rich automotive heritage 
and experiment. Iannone's vision for Ferrari's fashion line integrates the brand's iconic automotive aesthetics with contemporary fashion trends. The designs reflect Ferrari's core values of innovation, luxury and performance, appealing to both car enthusiasts and fashion lovers. So far, Ferrari has showcased eight collections, seven ready to wear for women and men, and their first research collection. Looking at the first spring-summer 22 women's and men's collection, I saw huge similarities with the design of Ferrari's Formula One drivers. Close uh, Iannone uses mountain bright colors, leather, nylon, and oversized silhouettes. But in the new Fall Winter 24 collection, something has happened. We are seeing a searingly bright trendy red, burgundy, and navy colors, and no more multicolored combinations or details. All looks are monochromatic, accessories and boots are so stylish, and these Ferrari gloves are beyond perfection. They combine sport car driving gloves with casual everyday one that gives them a really on-brand look. Transparent and glass effect fabrics, over-the-knee boots, fur coats and white gloves this year Trendy gloves are white and oversized. I can't wait to see the Ferrari Spring Summer 25 collection, which is going to be showcased this autumn in Milan. Rocco Iannone is creating amazing designs, and every season they are getting better and better. It is safe to say Ferrari, like Miu Miu or Jacques Mousse, are becoming a trend-setting brand. So, if you enjoyed, this video please click the thumbs up comment share i will be very happy and subscribe see you in the next video bye